Hey guys, what's up? It's Natalie Rea here and welcome to today's vlog. To start off, I think it's only right to show you guys our room. So we are staying at the Surat Hotel. This is the entrance right here and this is only walking distance to the old stone bridge right there which we will be checking out in a minute but first, let's start off with the hotel. Going into the hotel automatic doors. When you walk in, I actually love the way that this is because of these windows. It brings in so much light and it just makes it look a lot more vibrant. Right here, you have a cute little piano. Obviously, the reception and then at the elevator that leads to upstairs. You can either take those or go this way. There's also a cute little bar and a restaurant. Isn't this the cutest little elevator? This elevator is a little bit bigger than the one we got in our last hotel when we stayed in Nuremberg. I did forget my key. Okay, so walking into the room, ow! You got the bathroom to the left. Cute and tiny. I like the lighting in here. I also love these little mirrors. I think they always come in handy. Walking out of the restroom, we do have all of our stuff right here. Cute little long mirror for outfits of the day. We got a huge bed and then a small little TV. We got some wine over here, some chips. Also, the mini fridge came fully stocked. Actually, those two are Phoenixes, but it did have beers and a few other soft drinks. And this is our view. It's so cute. If you guys do end up coming to Regensburg, we just left the sausage kitchen and it does have an actual name. I just don't know how to pronounce it, so we're just gonna leave it at that. But it is very neat to come here, so if you guys are ever here, I definitely recommend it. We had such a good time, the food was good, and it is actually really cool to know that it is like one of the oldest restaurants in the world. It's also right next to the church and the old stone bridge. So our hotel is right across the bridge on the other side. Actually, it's right over there, but everything is so neat right here. I love this. We are thinking of taking one of those little boats, but definitely not this time. I do want to come during the summertime. I just think it's going to be a lot more enjoyable than being cold. I'm actually not cold right now just because it was really, really warm in there. So we already walked around the city hall. We already seen just a little bit of this town. We did go to eat already. We're now gonna walk some more and then we're gonna go to another restaurant that Phoenix wants to try out. All right guys, so someone told me that there is such thing as a TJ Maxx over here, except it's called TK Maxx. 
This is the first time that I've ever seen a TK Maxx and it's just straight ahead for me. And we're gonna go in. I just left TK Maxx and I wasn't able to go downstairs or upstairs because just to let you know, they do have both. But um, everything is just like TJ Maxx. I was just about to say TK Maxx, but obviously this is TK Maxx. Oh, this looks just like a little brew house. We just left the restaurant. Um, we had the pork shoulder. That the pork was actually really really good as well as the beer didn't like the potato the potato is like It's mashed potato, but it's like another it has definitely another name for the Germans Don't know what it is what they called it here and then also the sauerkraut. I didn't like that I thought it was a little bit too sour compared to the other place that we had and every other place that I've had it at This was my least favorite one other than that. It was a great restaurant thumbs up you spit on me. It was an accident. You were not supposed to walk in front of me. <laughs> I've been walking in front of you. Alright guys, it is 11 p.m. We took a very, very long nap, but we decided to go back into town. You guys, they have beer in a vending machine. Just left the little pirate bar. They do close at two and it is 1.40. So we didn't want to like keep them there. Anyway, so we just left. We're walking by another bar and it's called Mood. And it is definitely Mood AF. It is so freaking cute that I kind of don't want to go back to the hotel. I literally love it. I'm kind of salty about not going in there. Mood is definitely a spot that we're going to be checking out next time. Good morning, guys. It is now the next day. Last night, we ended up going to all those different places and then we just came back home and slept pretty much. It is 10 in the morning. We already checked out. We are going to be walking to the left side of the bridge this time just because yesterday we didn't get a chance to check that side out. So there's a few things that I want to do which is one, check out that left side and then also go back to the right side and go to a thrift shop which I passed by it twice yesterday. Actually like more like four times. But I kept seeing this romper and I can't stop thinking about it so I need to go back there and check it out. Is that a log? There's a log stuck. Mm, it makes it look cool and that was not there yesterday. Okay, and the third thing that I want to do is check out Ikea before we leave. Alright, so that's where we went yesterday which was to the right and this time we're going to be going to the left. Alright, there's nothing on that side. You guys, I just realized that there is three small rivers. So the one over there where the log is stuck, there's that middle section that kind of ends in our hotel and then there's this big one right here so this bridge does go all the way to the other one this place is closed i think i always forget that on sundays everything is closed and this kind of makes me sad i was really looking forward to checking this place out okay so let me tell you the reason why i wanted to come here for this little guy like Po vibes. It says it's 24.90, so I, I want to believe that, but I'm not too sure. And then also, if you look back in there, there's a shitload of fanny packs and like vintage bags. So I was really looking forward to that store, and honestly, everything is closed. We're on our way to IKEA. We're like two, three minutes away. Literally hoping that it is open. We made it to IKEA. Please. Let there be cars in the parking lot. What is going on? You guys, Ikea is closed. It's so bumming. 
I mean, you would think it's open. It's a huge store. All right, guys, it is now the next day. I actually didn't get to film any more yesterday. Just because it was such a long drive, I know it actually isn't a long drive. It's only like a one hour drive. However, I was just so tired. I literally slept through the entire ride over here. And once we got here, I think we ate and then we watched TV for a little bit and then we just went to bed. Anyway, so really quick, I want to recap about this entire vlog. Regensburg has now been my favorite place. First place that we went to was to Nuremberg and then we went to Czech Republic. And then we have gone to a few towns around Grafenbeer, so I won't count those. Then now that we went to Regensburg, I count that as the third big place that we've been to since being here. And out of those three, Regensburg is officially my favorite. I didn't get to film much in the nighttime just because everything is so dark, so the quality isn't the best. We had so much fun. We went to a few bars. I loved it. I love Regensburg. I think it's absolutely amazing. I really can't wait to go back in the summer. But anyways, I am going to end this video right here. I do want to give out a shout out today. And today's shout out goes out to Nancy Raya. Nancy! Thank you. Obviously, you guys could tell by the last name, Rhea. She is my cousin. So shout out to you, Nancy. And if any one of you guys will also like a shout out, all you have to do is to make sure to be subscribed and comment anything your big old heart desires. I love you guys all. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a huge thumbs up. Please subscribe down below if you are not subscribed to join the Rhea family. And I will see you guys soon. Bye, guys.